What's up YouTube? In this video I'm going to talk about Homebrew, what it is, why you should install it, and how to install it. We're going to install it as well. So I'm on a Mac, um, Homebrew's for Mac and Linux. I'm on a Mac, late 2012, so it's an older Mac. I, um, I do video and multimedia editing, so video editing, audio editing, image editing. There's a lot of free and open source programs out there, and some of them are sort of hard to install. Um, but homebrew makes that easier. So first let's just go, let's just type in homebrew on Google or I use Brave Search. It says homebrew, the missing package manager for Mac OS or Linux. What does homebrew do? It installs the stuff you need that Apple or your Linux system didn't. Um, in plain language, homebrew helps you install programs that uh, like using the command line in a very easy way. So two that I use very often are FFmpeg and YouTube DL. FFmpeg is like a command line video editing tool and YouTube DL is a command line tool to download YouTube videos. So once we install Homebrew, I'm gonna install those, but in this video I'm just gonna show you how to install Homebrew and really it couldn't be any easier. Um, under install homebrew it's got this long command if you just click this button right here that copies it to your clipboard um, open a terminal uh, you can just search terminal in your spotlight or go to your um, applications and in terminal all you have to do is paste so command V paste press enter it's gonna ask for your password and if you haven't used the terminal much um, just know that you'll type your password and you won't see anything so I'm typing right now it's not showing up but it is registering so I just type my password hit enter and then this comes up it says press return or enter to continue so I pressed enter and now I just wait so I'm gonna pause the recording and then I'm gonna come back when this is uh, installed once homebrew is done installing when it brings you back to your prompt that has your username and your computer name um, a few a few times during the installation it uh, took a while but you just need to wait until it prompts you to either press enter or type your password or or it you know says it installation successful um, after this I can use command plus to make this screen bigger and uh, and then I can type clear and that'll clear out the clear out all the history in my terminal window so now if I just type brew it uh, returns all these options that I can use with homebrew so this is basically proving that it is installed so now that I have it installed I can go ahead and um, find programs on it like I, I like I said before FFmpeg is one that I like to use and another one YouTube DL so I'll go through those in a future video but for now that is all that's how you download and install homebrew it's super easy you just paste that into your terminal and now you have it so thanks for watching I'll see you in the next video